Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm gonna be doing a haul with some of the items that I got during the career track trip. Today's video was actually recorded on the bus while I was heading back to Bowling Green from Cincinnati. Some of my peers actually wanted me to record this haul while we were heading back. So I was just like, sure, why not? So let's get this going. <laughs> So to start the haul off with, so uh, Miss Duval, she's the one who coordinated this trip. She gave us a Gordon Ford College of Business t-shirt to wear. Literally, I'm gonna wear this anytime, any chance that I get now that I have this. Like, it's like backwards on the screen, but if you can read backwards, like this is what it says. <laughs> that was like one thing that, that we pretty much got right at the beginning of the trip. And then when we went to Fidelity, this pen that I got, it's like a green man pen. It's so funny too because like whenever they were telling us about their mascot, they said like their unofficial official mascot was a frog, but like check it out. It's a green man, like ironic, right? And then we have another like green character. Check him out. He's like a, I guess he's supposed to be like a stress, stress reliever, like one of those stress balls, but instead it's a stress character. So if I'm ever stressed because final week, finals week is coming up soon, I'm just gonna be like, and his eyes pop out, like check that out. <laughs> the coolest thing that we got from Fidelity which um, I wasn't, I actually wasn't expecting to get anything like this during our whole trip was, I'm gonna say this like plastic tumbler. It says Fidelity on it. I've never been to a business where they like gave tumblers to like people who tour, which I think that was like one, definitely one thing that made them stand out. A lot of people these days use tumblers, um, especially like us college students, since we're constantly on the move and sometimes we don't have enough time to either get food or water, like having this kind of stuff with us is very beneficial. So like, I think, I thought that was like very, that was like very cool for them to have. That's Fidelity guys. Oh, and then of course we also have this Fidelity bag, you know, we're, we're repping the company. If I'm ever out like grocery shopping or something and I need a bag to just put my groceries in, like I could literally use this. Or this could also be used as like a lunch bag or maybe if I go to dance fitness, I could also use this bag, but like so many different uses and I'd be I'd be like a an ambassador in a way, repping the company. One of the other companies that we went to was Highland. One thing that I really like that they did for their, I guess for their like little goodie bag is that like they literally put like the name of the company right here. If I ever were to go back through like different bags or anything, then like I would always remember like this is from Highland, like this is specifically from them. So like that was one way they utilized marketing, which I thought was really cool. So they gave us a stress ball and then we also got a pen from them, it says Highland. And then I'm guessing this is a magnet clip on? What, what would this be called? Just a clip. It's a clip? Yeah. Okay, so like, I guess one of those ref refrigerator clips. So like, um, I don't really have a fridge in my dorm. So like, I guess I could just use this to like put papers together. Cause I have a feeling I'm gonna be, I'm gonna need to do that here in the next couple of weeks. And then, oh yeah, so, okay. Well, first of all, I got a notepad. Um, I like to take notes a lot, so this is gonna be very beneficial, especially since um, sometimes I like to stick, I like to like just take random notes or like I need something fast to write on. So I'm happy I have this because I personally don't have any post-it notes in my dorm. I think the most incredible, most important thing that I got from Highland was this business card right here. And the reason why I say that is because out of all the people there, um, this lady that I got a business card from, she was the only one that remembered my name. When she remembered my name, it made me kind of think like maybe I did something to make her remember me so especially since there was like what 19 of us um and yeah they all had our resumes and they kind of got a general idea of who we were but we didn't really get a chance to kind of like do anything like individually or anything like that so when she like remembered my name i was like yeah so this was definitely the the best part about going to highland right here that's pretty much all i got from highland today so that's another business down it, the next business is perfetti even though this is like a small bag and like of course as you guys can see it has like all their candy their gum and stuff on it Great way of marketing, by the way. In this very bag, I'm gonna say we have every product that they make in this bag. We have like the Mentos gum. <gasps> and I got the Mentos flavored gum. Okay, so earlier in the meeting, they initially passed out candy to everybody. And it was just like a handful. So like anybody could grab whatever fell on the table. A lot of people grabbed this before I had the chance to, and there were, no there were none left. So I'm very happy to find this in the bag. But there's like all sorts of airheads. They also have their um, Chupa Chups lollipops, which they pretty much considered it like an adult lollipop. I'm excited to try these because I've never tried like Chupa Chups before, so that's that's gonna be interesting. Um, I wish I could show you guys everything, but like there's so much in this thing and it's like loaded. So maybe I'll uh, maybe I'll just show you. I'll I'll just do 
a breakdown another time for this bag. Like, whenever we went to St. Elizabeth, it didn't seem like they had like any goodie bags or anything prepared. So like I really wasn't expecting to get anything from them. But they were the other business that we got a, like a tumbler from. It's a, like a mini tumbler. It's really, really cute. I don't know what I'm going to use it for just because like I like to use bigger, bigger tumblers or bigger water bottles. But I'm... I'm definitely going to be utilizing this somehow in the future. Um, if this is plastic and not actual glass, I might use it during the winter time for hot chocolate, but we'll just have to test it out and see. The last company that we went to was CVG. That's actually the company that we're coming back from now. CVG gave us a lot more, but like some of that stuff is like all the way down in my other bag, and I'm like, you know what? It's fine. But, um, <laughs> you weren't supposed to. Okay. <laughs> So Alfredo came in clutch. <laughs> so one of the things CBG gave us was um, a tire pressure, what, what is this called? Yeah, a tire gauge. A tire gauge. Funny story about this tire pressure gauge is that one of my peers from the trip, we were talking about it before the presentation started. She said that like she would never have to use this just because <laughs> she would never have to use this just because she would never change her own tire. And I literally made the point, I was like, well, like what if you're ever stuck in the middle of nowhere and you like don't get service or anything and you can't call your insurance to change your tire for you? Because you know, she said that like her she has insurance for that kind of stuff, and she was just like 911 always is available which I was like that's actually a good point but yes so like I think this was like really cool and like there was one point in my life where like I needed a tire gauge a tire pressure gauge but like I just never like had the chance to buy one so like I'm very happy to have gotten this and then we also got a name tag holder I guess for like luggage and stuff like that first of all it says CVG on it so like another form of marketing right there I don't know if I have any luggage that still need name tags on it I probably do. I'm definitely gonna find some way to utilize this, whether it's on my backpack or anything. Okay, so I didn't know this was a thing, but Alfredo just told me this is a wire holder. Um, it, I've never heard of like this being a thing before. So if you guys have, put it in the comment section below or put a link of other wire holders that exist. Cause I didn't know, did not know this was like a thing, but this was also another thing that CVG gave us. So we also got lip balm. And let me tell y'all, when I saw this thing, I was like super happy slash excited just because I think it was the first day of the trip, my Carmex ran out. So literally I've been using like the little traces of my Carmex left to like kind of uh, to put like on my lips and it has not been helping. And I've been worried the whole time that like I would like get dry lips. But like once I saw this, I was like, I was like slathering right on. Like you can judge me, but like that's literally what happened. And then we got a reusable straw from CPG. This was the last thing we got. I'm not gonna lie. I thought this was something else. I did not think this was, this had a reusable straw in it. I don't really use straws, but um, if I ever need one, I'll have it in this little CPG like carrier right here. Well, that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed today's career trek haul. Just like always, if you're new here, like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me out. Definitely hit the notification button if you want to keep up with all my posts. Since it is summer break, I'm going to be trying to post as much as I can. There's a lot of things I want you guys to see, especially my summer adventure series. I actually already made my draft plan, and some of the things on that draft plan is going to be really fun. And I cannot wait to have an actual, real summer adventure. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!